Welcome back to The Daily Poem here on the Close Reads Podcast Network. I'm David Kern. Today's poem is by Sarah Teasdale. I've read one of her poems before on this show. She lived from 1884 to 1933 and was an American lyric poet from Missouri. The poem that I'm going to read today is called Barter. It goes like this. Life has loveliness to sell, all beautiful and splendid things, blue waves whitened on a cliff, soaring fire that sways and sings, and children's faces looking up, holding wonder, like a cup. Life has loveliness to sell, music like a curve of gold, scent of pine trees in the rain, eyes that love you, arms that hold, and for your spirit's still delight, holy thoughts that star the night. Spend all you have for loveliness. Buy it and never count the cost. For one white singing hour of peace, count many a year of strife well lost. And for a breath of ecstasy, give all you have been or could be. Sarah Teasdale does a lovely job uh, maintaining the focus on her extended metaphor here. The extended metaphor that of selling and bartering, that life itself has something to sell uh, to us or to barter with us. Of course, uh, bartering and selling is a transaction. So not only does uh, life have loveliness to sell, which of course she tells us three times in the beginning of each of the three stanzas, but also it's going to expect something in return. So as we read this poem, you know, the implication is that somewhere along the way, the poet is going to reveal to us what it is that we have to offer back. <laughs> and the interesting thing is, it's uh, not that specific. So the first two stanzas um, talk about all the loveliness. And then what it is that, what is it that we have to give back? The beginning of stanza three tells us that it's everything. Spend all you have for loveliness. Buy it and never count the cost. Count many a year of strife well lost, and for a breath of ecstasy, give all you could have been or could be. So, so the trade is nothing short of everything we have, uh, whatever it takes, all we have been or could be. That's a, quite the premium Sarah Teasdale is putting on, on loveliness. It reminds me, of course, of Jesus telling the, the rich young ruler to sell all you have and, and follow him. I think uh, Sarah Teasdale is certainly uh, playing on that, referencing that, that, using that as an illusion. But I was thinking about how Sarah Teasdale, you know, she lived a short life. She was dealt with a lot of depression in her life. And when she was quite young, she was sick. She was very poor health for much of her childhood. And so I imagine that things like loveliness, the things that she describes here, music like a curve of gold, scent of pine trees in the rain, the eyes that love you, how blue waves whitened on a cliff, a soaring fire, children's faces looking up. All these things were probably quite precious to her as she, as she struggled through, uh, through depression, through her illnesses. And you can imagine that she, in those moments of depression, she had to cling uh, quite resolutely to those images. And so I think that's one of the reasons why the specificity of the images um, is in this poem. It's not just that it makes a good poem, but it's that these things rang true to her because of their specificity, because she would cling to those images, not just for her verse, but in some ways for her, for her own pleasure, for her sanity, for, um, for her own happiness. And uh, so for her, it wasn't too much to say that you had to give up everything. And I think a lot of people who deal with anxieties and depression, this kind of idea can resonate with them. And in that way, I think... This is also one of those poems that's, that's great for spring as winter's ending and we're entering into spring, but perhaps winter's lingering. Uh, these kind of images, this kind of poem can be um, inspiring and, uh, and worthwhile. Putting to memory even. I think this is a very memorizable poem, incidentally. So, all right, here is Barter by Sarah Teasdale. Life has loveliness to sell, all beautiful and splendid things. Blue waves whitened on a cliff. Soaring fire that sways and sings, and children's faces looking up, holding wonder like a cup. Life has loveliness to sell, music like a curve of gold, scent of pine trees in the rain, eyes that love you, arms that hold, and for your spirit's still delight, holy thoughts that star the night. Spend all you have 
for loveliness. Buy it. Never count the cost. For one white singing hour of peace, count many a year of strife well lost. And for a breath of ecstasy, give all you have been or could be. This has been The Daily Poem. Thanks so much for listening. I'll be back tomorrow with another one for you.